Good morning, Philippines. Good morning, YouTube. It is day, build day number 81 here at Costa Texpina. Um, we are continuing with the roof beams, uh, doing the forms. They will be pulling the forms from what they poured yesterday. Um, over on this side, they are continuing with uh, plaster coating. Um, I hear the grinder going in the back. Um, not sure exactly what they're cutting, but we'll take a look here in a momentarily. Um, I believe the welders will be con uh, coming back in and they're going to continue working uh, more trying to find the uh, roof pitch or verifying what was on the plans uh, for the roof pitch. And so we'll see uh, how they're doing as we go throughout the day. Um, so let's get started. Starting back here in bedroom number two, we got some guys that are working on forms for the roof beams and columns, and they'll continue to work those today. Probably be most likely pour this afternoon. Go ahead and look back out here on the front. <clears throat> Have uh, Mr. Talk, our electrician is in the living room continuing to chip out conduit chases your foreman is also chipping out he's now a termite ah. <laughs> i've got proof the, the the foreman actually does do work <laughs> he's uh, doing a little cleanup on the floors <clears throat> just joke he works hard, keeps these guys working. And on this side, they're already starting to do plaster coat on the front side of the uh, master closet. All right, we're gonna do a quick mid-morning walk around. Um, most of the work's about pretty much the same. These guys are still working on... Um... <laughs> that's, a, that's a lot of sweat there, brother. <laughs> He's wringing his shirt out and it's like dripping like somebody poured water down him. Poor guy. <laughs> they're, they're sweating like crazy out here. Hot and high humidity. But they're, they're um, continuing to do the roof beam and um, column forms right now. So they're going to they're gonna form most of this up. They, they should be pouring this this afternoon. Um, the engineer was here yesterday afternoon and put the, uh, the mason work up on top for the attic on hold until the welders can uh, get their game plan together for um, the the roof lines how they're going to get those going um, over here on this side back down here on the bottom um, they're already doing the screening portion for the um, plaster coating so we're continuing to work that and then Today, the welders brought in a little bit thicker line, um, so you should be able to see the string line now. Since it's not a string line, it's more of a, a, a raffia straw type thing, kind of like a, a, a small plastic rope. It's still kind of hard to see for you guys. Sorry about that. Um, yeah. It's there. Let's see if I can get it from a different angle. Okay, from up under here. Ah, here we go. Maybe y'all can see this. Okay, you see they've got one going from the top uh, down to where they're trying to find where the side's gonna be for the back porch. And then the one from this side comes this way. There it is right there. And it's coming to this, this top corner. <clears throat> so they're still trying to get the corners figured out. Um, once they get a, a good working plan, they will should start putting in trusses at some point just to try to get the, uh, the lines going. The engineer wanted to see what the lines look like with the thicker rope so that it's easier to visualize. 
uh, once that's done. So he should be out here a little later this afternoon. and Mr. Jericho are building forms. We got Mr. Lance and Mr. Gabby making, uh, appears to be making more mortar for the uh, plaster coat. Could be concrete, we'll have to see. Uh, see if they add in rock or not. Okay, working the western way around. I'm guessing that they're probably going to end up pouring concrete or making concrete because Mr. Anjo is right up here and looking like he's ready to start pouring uh, some additional um, roof beams the rest of the way around. And over on the master side of the house. Oh, that's pretty. Um, the master's side of the house, we are continuing to plaster coat on the, now onto the southern wall of the uh, master's closet. Up here on top, you see Mr. Donde, he is the foreman for the uh, welders, this guy here. Um, <laughs> they're having a bit of a struggle. This. Uh, this roof design is uh, severely complicated, uh, more so than what your typical uh, your typical roof design is on most Philippine style houses. Um, so this has got a lot more hips and gable uh, hip, hip style roof uh, projections than what they're used to. 
<clears throat> so they're they're having a little difficulty they're getting it done um, but they are today I think they're making a lot more progress and it does look a lot better um, you should be able to see the faint outline of the uh, raffia that they're using uh, to help guideline as far as where it's going to be at and what it's going to look like <clears throat> for some of the lower lower sections um, at the as they get moving along, this will this will show up a lot better. Um, I'm glad that we're able to use the uh, raffia today because at least you you guys can see that on the video. At least I can see it on the GoPro here. So if I can see it on the GoPro, you guys should definitely be able to see it on the on the video. Okay, well that's about where everybody's at this afternoon. All right, I'm going to zoom in on this so you guys can see it. That is a gorgeous shot of Mount Riot. One of the main reasons we got our house on this side of the subdivision. So after a little bit of discussion, they're starting to work on the front entryway. Uh, the porch here is what's outlined with the hollow blocks where Mr. Gabby here is digging out. He's digging out to the hollow block that was buried as part of the foundation wall. From at that point, it'll do a step up to where it'll be on the same level as the floor on the inside of the house. And then as you come in, right over here, just before this column, the door will be right here. So it'll go all the way across. It's got um, side lights, oh, well, side windows, and a transom across the top. And then one large door that's gonna swing in to the left okay so that's what that's supposed to look like all right mr jericho here is working the uh front stoop front landing front porch yes that place by the front door Now the idea is that the, the floor is going to be level with the top of this grade beam here. And then it'll take a step down on this side and probably uh, it might be one or two steps down at that point. We'll have to watch it and see how, they, how it plays out. Talking with the welder foreman, what these gentlemen here are doing is building a ladder beam or a lateral beam um, that's going to go from this side of the roof, cross the media room, cross the, the attic floor to just inside the half bath here and it'll come up above that's where it'll connect on this side to do all of the slopes down on that all the pitches down on that side of the building so this should be straight down the middle over to this one so they're kind of getting started today i'm pretty sure they're going to leave it um, they're not going to connect obviously to the other end uh, don't have enough time in the end of the day to, to catch it today but they do have all of the um, all of the scaffolding is secured via steel wires. It's not really going anywhere. Um, plus, overnight it should be good to go with these guys. All right, that's uh, progress. We're making forward progress on our on our roof line. So started off today with the straw the straw roof yeah started off today with the straw roof which you see here coming back up this way that'll be for the pitches going over the top of the master suite and then this large one here 
will be a, the column going up and then the roof beam, lateral roof going this way. So this will actually be the, uh, the, the roof ridge, the top roof ridge uh, going on that, going on that, uh, that line. All right, like I said, good forward progress today. All right, we're gonna close out on uh, build day number 81. As here lately, it just started raining within the last couple minutes. Um, the guys finished up with the concrete pour around the front of bedroom number two. Um, as I was showing you a little earlier, the welders have a plan. Um, they're starting to put that, that into action. Uh, so we're gonna see a lot more uh, of the roof come together uh, over the next couple weeks. Um, they are going to continue with the rest of the plaster coating around the outside of the building over the next couple days and look forward to seeing it. Um, if you like today's video, please give us a big thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of these videos, hit the Costa Tex Pina star right over here and you'll be subscribed. Hit the, view, uh, the bell icon just below the view screen and you'll be notified when our next video is uploaded for your viewing pleasure. Until then, stay dry, <laughs> uh, have a great afternoon, and God bless. Thank you for watching. If you liked today's video, please hit like, subscribe, and hit the little bell icon to be notified when our next video becomes available.